the bill. Back over to you. Our ongoing rain now bringing flooding issues to our area. I want to check in with John Hopperstead. He's live in Snoqualmie right now, where the flood warning for the Snoqualmie River at the falls in Incarnation has been upgraded to major now. John, what are you seeing? Well, Bill, we are seeing the waters continue to rise here. We are along the Mill Pond Road. Give you an idea, last hour when we talked to you, we were down past those power poles. That was where the flooding was beginning, and now we have been moved way, way back here, and this entire road is overrun with water right now, and it's getting deeper as we speak. Right now, we're talking about a phase four for the Snoqualmie and the Tolt River. King County officials say that's unusual. They don't really see that except maybe once every four or five years. Uh, the King County, though, does say the water starting to drop upriver, but it's still rising down here, and it is creeping into homes now as well. I think we have a picture from the Snoqualmie Fire Department of a neighbor there. Uh, you could see water going up the driveway, and the cars are underwater as well at this point. We have seen King County flood officials out here on foot patrol checking out the river levels. Snoqualmie moving very fast and rising. It's taking down a lot of vegetation. Even some large trees as well, and that's bringing some neighbors out with their flashlights to monitor the situation. When uh, you start seeing, you know, two inches, three inches of rain, and so that just kind of gets your heart rate going. <laughs> when you start to see debris in the water, I mean, that's uh, it's, it's uh, bringing a lot of logs, as you can see, and debris. So it's pretty pretty hard up river. Flooding is something that folks around here are used to, especially this time of year, but uh, we are right now seeing a lot of roads overtaken with river water right now. And even though the rain has stopped that bulge of water up the forks, it takes a while to get down river. So again, we are seeing the waters recede upriver, but we're seeing them still rise here downriver. And we have seen uh, this road in particular get overtaken by water in just the last hour. So we're going to take off from here and check out some more roads around the area. But we're being told that there are several roads right now that are underwater in the Snoqualmie and Carnation area. Guys, we'll send it back to you. All right, John, appreciate the update.